after a couple delays, we're at Aries Resort to ride Aries Alpine Coaster today. Like I said in a future vlog, we will be doing this. And we got Ryan here. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready to do this. Um, Jeez. This is my third Alpine Coaster of the week. Oh yeah, because you were just were at Silver Dollar City a couple uh, days ago, which uh, uh, we do have to get to the Alpine Coaster by going up this uh, uh, ski lift right here. And we'll have you emphasize more on your experience of the park because yeah. uh, I wasn't there, obviously. So right. you have to explain uh, what your experience is like because you actually have a cool Silver Dollar City shirt on. You got that yeah. on the yeah. front and then turn around and to the back. That's pretty cool. So yeah, we're gonna get to the top of uh, the mountain, I guess we could say, where we got the coaster. This will actually be my third ever Alpine coaster because I've only done two in Tennessee. I've done the Smoky Mountain Alpine coaster and then the coaster that's found at the Goats on the Roof in Pigeon Forge. So this will be my third Alpine coaster and I'm excited to see how it holds up. So let's go give it a ride. We got our wristbands now, so we'll be able to head up the hill here. And while we're waiting, Ryan, do you wanna ever talk about your experience in Silver Dollar City? So first, um, Ride counts, I guess. Uh, sure. Okay, so. Give me your total ride count for the both days you were there. Nine on Outlaw Run, six on Time Traveler, five on Wildfire, four on Powder Keg, two on Fire in the Hole, one on Mystic River Falls, one on American Plunge, one on Firefall, you did Thunder Asia, one right? on Barn Swing, one on Thunder Asia. So you got a decent amount of rides in there. And wait, you said also flooded mines. Did you, did you talk about I that? I did do two flooded mine rides as well. So the first flooded mine ride gun didn't work at all and yeah. the second one i worked and i got 103,600. awesome so outlaw run moved up in my list eight spots um powder king moved up 26 spots time traveler moved up 22 spots and wildfire moved up 50 spots so nice. and uh you did something with time traveler want to say what you did with it well i got a zen ride on yep. time traveler <laughs> totally got a zen ride and you also got uh, Outlaw Run Rain Rides. And, uh, yep, we got our, uh, uh, what you call it, our chair thing is up to the top, skew up. All right, guys, we gotta make you back these yellow All right, course. and uh, we'll, uh, next year gets close, I'll give you guys a free one count, you guys be good to see. All right, so uh, I'll have Ryan keep talking about his experience once we start heading up here. And we are on the way up right now, and I have not done one of these in quite a while, so not gonna lie, this is a little bit uh, janky, I guess you could say, because it's literally bouncing up and down right now. And uh, I think we should be seeing the Alpine Coaster on our right here. So, and, and yes, I drove my camera with me, so we'll be trying to get some footage of it. Let's get back to where we left off with the Silver Dollar City ride. So, first day was amazing. Not hardly any lines were too long, except for powder kegs. Well, that's powder keg. It has a long line um, pretty much all the time. Then the second day happened, and all's good. The first day, I rope dropped Time Traveler, got the front row of that. So. And back row, which he finally did, because he had gotten uh, only two middle car rides. And the back drop is unreal it's like yep <laughs> some of the strongest ejector you'll feel on a drop let alone sideways ejector for that matter yep um and then i rope dropped powder cake the second day and i got a front row ride on that and and he got a back row ride the day before and he wanted to try front row so that's what he did yep front row. and, and plus there were assigning rows anyway they were assigning rows and i got there in front and then when i went up there and i got there first the guy wanted me to go to row two what and why? I don't know why. Um, then the people in the second row thought that was unfair, so they switched me, and I ended up getting. Oh wait, row, wait! So, so someone line jumped you? No, they didn't line jump me. The uh, oh, I thought you were first in line though. Well, I was first in line. The thing was, I was first in line, but the worker wanted the people behind me to go in row one, and they wanted me to go in row two. Oh, that's lame. So kind of lame if you ask me. So then. The people that were in row two thought that was unfair, so they let me go in row one, which I should have rightfully had from the beginning. Absolutely, so. you were first one there. You should have gotten first dibs of uh, where you sat. So then I uh, sat next to a guy with a wildfire shirt. Nice. <laughs> Gotta love the merch that has a Gerslauer Euro fighter on it. <laughs> no, you're kidding. Yep. Oh boy. Um, and powder keg in the front row is like that. That's it. That that was my first big roller coaster. Yep. Um, Fire in the Hole was my second ever, and Grand Exposition was my first. So nice. it's going to be a sad, sad end to Fire in the Hole because yep. that's a nostalgic coaster for me. And it looks like we're almost come to a nearly complete stop. Uh, oh, I don't know what's going on here. So then on that Friday, the second day I had, started raining. Oh, no. Midway this through the day. Uh, Alaron, you saw it overshoot the final brakes. So. 
so first what happened was I was so I, I rode Thunderation then then got in line for time traveler well then it started raining and I got a back I got a front row ride and then went back around for another rain ride in the front row on uh, which uh, ride Thunderation round we're talking about time traveler oh time traveler and then there was no one in the station so I got a Zen ride on it. Yeah, which we already talked about. You got for, a Zen ride. For some reason. Then I went straight back to Outlaw Run, and I was the next person to get online, and it overshot the brakes. So then I waited 20 minutes. They ran three test trains and a test train with a uh, ride up. Ride up. And keep on, he said it was only on one train when he was there for that time. For the first or second day, it was on one train. Um, and then I got to ride it twice in the rain and it was running the best it's ever ran yep because uh i i've gotten a rain ride on a couple of rmc's i did out run in the rain in 2020 and uh also i rode goliath at six flags great america in the rain in 2019 and uh out run rain rides when i rode it in 2020 i'm like that's exactly what goliath felt like in 2019 so uh that was just a uh, awesome and mm. overall best surprise of the trip what was it biggest surprise for you biggest surprise was Probably wildfire jumping up 50 spots. Yeah, wildfire jumped up quite a bit in my list after my most recent rides in 2021. And if you saw my vlog from Silver Dollar City in 2022, which I'll post the link to that in the description of this video, you'll know that uh, pretty much nothing was open the whole day. So I didn't get to ride Outlaw Run, Wildfire, Powder Keg, or Time Traveler. So that's unfortunate. And uh, looks like we're getting fairly close to the top of the hill, I think. But we still don't see the Alpine Coaster. Yeah, it'll probably be somewhere in those trees over there. And uh, I'll have my camera right so I can get some shots of it running if possible and if we see it. So let's keep an eye out for that. Should be a. Bye. If you can, there should be a locker thing. being a typical enthusiast getting some shots of this ride when I feel like I shouldn't need to. But to be clear, I'm doing it for the copyright free off-ride footage which is all posted at the end of the year. We're gonna hop on in a little bit and uh, see what's up. And, oh yeah, Ryan got a season pass for this place, so that's pretty That's cool. a Branson coaster card. Oh, that, that was for that. Oh, okay, that was for this. Okay. Yeah, we'll uh, go on and give it so there's pretty much no line, so that's nice. <laughs> This is going to be number 236 for me. Ryan, what number coaster will this be for you? 279. All right, 279. So, oh man, I'm excited. Look at what we got down there. So this is going to be a great experience. Hopefully, I've done two Alpine coasters and I enjoyed them. So let's see how this one is. And you've done uh, multiple other ones. What's the best? Well, I'm three this year already. Yeah, what's the best one you've ever ridden? Rocky Mountain Coaster. Right, and that's over in Colorado, which I obviously have never, I wasn't there. I had my, I think my favorite is the one at uh, Smoky Mountain Alpine Coaster in Pigeon Forge. All right. All right, so we're going to hop on and See how this one goes. Ryan just 
took off a few minutes ago and I'll be on in just a second here. We just got off of Aries Alpine Coaster. I had a blast on that thing. What'd you think of that? It was really good. I liked it. The laterals were great on it. Yes, there were some really strong laterals and uh, I was going full speed the whole time. Did you have to break it all? No. Yep, same here. I was flying down the thing. It was awesome. So there was like a little kink, like a little dip that like was a little jolt. But, and then that? at the end, like at the end, there's like a big downhill section. Yes, I got airtime on that. Yeah. I wasn't expecting it. I was like, okay, that thing's insane. Yeah. A big airtime hill at the end but so. all right now for me does it make top 25 i don't think so top 50 maybe Ooh. it's like neck and neck with the copperhead mountain coaster but i think the copperhead mountain coaster is just a slightly better than this and so. so this is not as good as the one you did in colorado which i forgot what the name so, was yeah this is this is uh third out of the six alpine coasters i've done nice really fun ride there ryan and i have now finalized our rankings for where we rank aries alpine coaster ryan what number do you rank aries alpine coaster at 78 all right for me i said i was top 50 where exactly 35 out of 236 for me i had it above powder cake and silver dollar city but below diamondback at king's island it was just a blast of a ride man i had so much fun just plowing through the trees going full speed I don't think I really noticed the trim brakes at all. Did you notice them? No, only uh, the first turn. Yeah, that was the only one I noticed. But other than that, I was just hauling. Yeah. Like, crazy. Man, yeah. awesome. So, right in front of West Coast Racers and right behind right behind Copperhead Mountain Coaster. Okay, I didn't realize you actually on like back to back. Yeah, they are very close. Yep. Very close. I agree with that. Like, well, I mean, I haven't done those yet, obviously. You should, uh, when we go to, in July, to Silver Dollar City. Eh, he could be teasing possible content for the channel coming soon. You never know what could happen. But overall, Aries Alpine Coaster, did you have fun? Yes, I had a lot of fun. Yep, that was just... The, oh. the just clear path of sight and you're the only one in the car is great. I know, like, this thing is literally my type of ride. Like, I really like coasters have a great sense of speed. That thing was phenomenal. Definitely worth the time. And I'd say give it a try if you're going from uh, Six Flags St. Louis to here. Yeah, like if you're going from like Six Flags St. Louis to uh, like Great America or Holiday World, I'd say it's worth like the, I don't know, you don't, you only need like what, an hour or so? Yeah, an hour. Yeah. Yeah, like an hour or maybe it'll leave a little more than that if you're going to do like multiplies, which he and I are only going to do one ride. But I'd say it's worth giving a try. So that was overall a really solid ride. I normally would end up the vlog right about now, but we're kind of exploring doing some, uh, I guess like sightseeing, I guess. No, they're not exactly. There's like some lookout area that's this way. And uh, it's overlooking the, what is it, the Mississippi River, Ryan? Yeah, Mississippi. So I don't know which river it is, but I think it was Mississippi River. But it's like, I don't know, like a fourth of a mile. This was like some crazy lookout point. And uh, we're going to take a look at it because the view you get at Mississippi River from uh, the ski lift on the way up here is absolutely insane. So we're going to go and uh, take a look at this and see what the cool view is like. Because back there, it looks phenomenal. So let's see what's over here. While walking along this uh, pathway, which you can kind of see the Mississippi River way out there, we found this uh, ring toss thing where it's like first player to get all six of their color rings on their color post is the winner. Unfortunately, I've like five black things there's a uh, apparently there's one missing unless i'm not seeing it anywhere which i don't think so right i'm gonna try and see who can get the first to get all five of our things onto the color posts and then we'll go from that all right ryan start us off and he overshot it all right let's see what i can do i completely I screwed that one up missed let's try a little bit better this time yeah oh yeah yeah this is harder than it looks Oh, that Darn it! Ah. First to get three, okay? Alright, first to get three sounds good. Sorry, I'm trying to do this one handed while filming. Oh. Darn it! Yeah. You are kidding me. Oh. Ah. I still got one more. I don't know what that was. Gotta try this new mounted approach, see how I do. Ryan's shooting right now, and he missed. I, I almost got it, it was the wrong one though. Yes, oh, snap! Got one. So Ryan's got one. I got uh, land the uh, last five. Well, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Oh! Uh, now wait for the record, Ryan. If it lands on uh, the opposite color post, does it count? No. Okay, so he almost landed it on the same one. So we'll uh, to, uh, see what happens here. But uh, I'm gonna shoot again, see what I can do. That was way short on my part. No! Oh, Ryan messed up. I'm going for the one that wants the back. I completely missed. <laughs> what was that? Bro. Oh. And that was even worse. Oh, Jeez. So I got one on my 
Again, that's the same one. Also, are we not gonna talk about the way that it just swirled on there like that? Oh my gosh, I almost messed up. Oh my gosh, it's like that thing has a magnet. Oh, oh that was a bad, pathetic shot. Oh. Dang it. Going for that one in the back right corner, which I completely missed again. That thing has a magnet. <laughs> Ryan's saying these things are magnets, not like me. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what that was. That was pathetic. Uh, Dang it! Right in the middle. Oh darn! I felt like I had it. Uh, what was that? that? Died. I almost landed on yours. Ah! Uh, you. Oh my uh, god! What was that? Ah! Uh, Super high shot. Yo, that almost worked, I feel like. Ah! Ah, I felt good about that last one. Ryan's got one, and I have not made a single one yet. Oh! Almost gets it. Okay, that was really weird. Ah! Uh, I didn't know what that was. No! I'm going under the legs. Okay, that was... No. <laughs> <laughs> that was pathetic. I don't know if you... I don't think you got solid. I tried to do one under the legs, and it failed, so... Let's not try that again. I'm trying to get all fancy, and I can't make one. Oh, right, you that, makes that super one again. Third time. And I completely overshoot it. Sheesh. Yeah, oh, two, two. oh gosh, I got some catching up to do. Oh. Oh, oh snap! Putting the pressure on me now. Dang it! Oh. Uh, I if I make all three of these right now, I win. Which is not gonna happen. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on, I thought that was it. Oh, no! Dang it, I thought it was going to be it again. Ryan's on with his last one, guys. Let's see what he can do. Oh! oh. Dang it. Oh. oh, my gosh. I don't know, that was, that was a runaway. Oh, I hit the book! Oh, that looked oh. like it would have been good. Oh! Shit. Oh man. Darn. Ryan keeps trying for the front left one. He thinks he can get off of that. Oh. And he almost gets it. Oh, it flipped. And, uh, my miss throw almost landed. And that, what was that, Ryan? It was a miss. Uh, that was even worse than yours. Oh. Ah. I, the back left. I don't know what me. I'm trying at this point. Oh, oh my gosh. Ah, I thought that was it. Ah, oh. oh, dang it. Oh my yeah. gosh. I might as well throw him on there and see what else I don't know, see if, how many more you can make, because you okay. already beat me, destroyed me 3-0. Oh. And you almost flexed on me and made it. Oh my gosh, that was, that was weird. Okay, that was dog water. I don't know what that was. Ah. Oh. I am not even trying at this point anymore. You want? Know <laughs> oh! I don't know what I was doing out. there. Yep, Brian got me 3 0. What a view out there. Oh, also got a couple buzzards. birds in the sky. Buzzards, yeah. Nothing wrong with a couple birds. Bro, why is there literally a bit of random gasoline thing right there? What the heck? Wait, what? You think it was a zip line here? Well, it looked like it used to be because then. Ah! This one that is very possible. Also, what a view that is, huh? Pretty cool. And stupid flies are bothering me. Oh my gosh, there's another ring toss. Ryan, I'm challenging to do a rematch. Okay. Right now. Let's do this. Better of a view this time. Last time the view wasn't so great. So let's see what we got to work with here. Yes. Ah. Ah, so I'm shooting from the back side of the post where I have my thing mounted. Oh, that was darn close. Dang it. Ah, I need some. Payback after what happened last game. Oh, of course, that was almost his. No! Oh, just missed it. Now we're gonna try and see who can get it to four first. Oh, no. Oh, snap, I made one. one. I made one on the right pillar. Yep. Yep. Okay, okay I'm, I'm glad it wasn't the same one. I wasn't when I counted. Or are we playing like that? But like, if it lands the same one, it counts as two, or not? Like, if I land another one of the one I just did, like it counts as another. Oh, it does. Okay, I didn't know that. 
I didn't know where the fire alarm was. Okay. That was way over the top. I don't know what I was thinking there. Oh, uh, I'm done for the backside again. Because the uh, other angle, I couldn't get a good view of it. Dang it. I missed. That was bad. Nope. Dang it. That was way over. Ah, dang it. That was absolute trash. Ah! I'm dark. I don't know what's in there. Oh, either. you gotta be kidding me. That was good. Oh, that bounced off the top of it. You guys saw that. Oh, snap. Yeah, Ryan ties it up. One to one. Why do I always hit that exact spot every time? Ah. Ah. Oh, he almost got ahead of me there. I would have whipped it off of his. I... He takes the lead from me. Okay. Oh, that hit off my knee. Oh my <laughs> gosh. He started at zero last round. Now he's already got one more win because we have to have to four. So if he throws it right here, he wins. Oh! Ah! ah, dang I it. I love this. I love that front left. Oh, the middle right. I just knocked this off the thing. That's what. Oh, you whack. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, that was there. <laughs> Tell me you guys didn't see that. Wow. Ah, these flies are bothering me. Ryan, hurry up so we can get out of here. <laughs> no. Another one. Okay, that, I don't know what that was. Ah! Yes, oh, I got that. All right, I need two more. I could catch up here with these last two. Ah! Ah! Door still open. Ah! Door still oh, open. Man. Oh my gosh, I almost got three. Oh, this is getting intense, guys. Me coming back and winning this is not out of the question, but Ryan needs one more. Ah! And he almost got it right there. Oh my gosh, this is it. <laughs> oh my gosh, just as I'm saying it. Oh my gosh, if I come back and snatch this win. Ah. Oh my gosh, Ryan. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I need this up right here, guys. Dang it. Oh man, it's coming down to the wire. It's anybody's game. All we need is one left for both of us. Panthers Bruins, game seven overtime. Oh jeez. Let's see what Let's happens see if here. The Panthers or the Bruins win. Well, who is who between the two of us? I'm the Panthers. You're the Bruins. All right, fair <laughs> enough. I don't know which team or which game they're from. But... Oh. oh. Okay, that was way off. I don't know what that was. It's oh, come Panthers on! Wait, I could still come back though. Oh. It's over. I don't know. I'm gonna just throw these last down and see if I can get any of them. Freaking flies! All right, you know what? Yes! I had to do it. Not sure this is a good idea, but now Ryan and I are screwing around. We're trying to make some crazy trick shot. Ryan's on the swing right here. What? Ah, no. That was horrible. I think you gotta do it from way higher up, bro. Not higher like this. Okay. Yeah. Let's we'll try that again. Going. Oh, he's got more elevation. Go for it. Next time to come back, go for it. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Oh. Dang it. Ah, just missed. Ryan, you madman! What are you doing? I'm tired, man. <laughs> what is wrong with this crazy human? Twist. Yes. Yes. Twisty! Oh my god, no! Twisty. Stop it! You're gonna hurt yourself and I'm not gonna be responsible for it. <laughs> oh, are you okay? Yeah. Bro, what is wrong with you? <laughs> that was, oh that was, my gosh. That was fun. Yeah, that was. I was kind of terrified you were gonna fly out the swing and face plant, which. These rocks would not be very nice to land on. Now what are you doing? This ain't pretty stable, isn't it? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Dude, thing. you're gonna break it and then we're gonna be in trouble. Wee! Ryan, that's not like that was about to snap and have it any second. You need to be careful. Oh look, there's a bald faced hornet. Seriously? Yeah. Oh, I don't want to go anywhere near there. Screw that area. After throwing some rocks at some random stuff, like out into the trees and stuff uh, at the top of the hill, we finished our day here. And final ride count, obviously it was just one on Aries Alpine Coaster. Did you have fun, Ryan? I loved it. That was a great time. Yep. And I'm like extremely tired because I was throwing a bunch of rocks all over the place. And 
Yeah, those uh, ring toss things we did, you beat me by... <laughs> you destroyed me the first time, the second time I was like really close. Yep. If I think, I, I think uh, if we were doing the three in the second one, I would have beaten you. No, I had three and it, three to, it was three to one. Oh, I, 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 came, I nearly came back, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. So that was a, overall a really fun time. And as usual, before you click off this video, please make sure to leave a like and be sure to comment about what you enjoyed about this video and what else you think you'd like to see improved upon. And be sure this video is someone else may not. If you're new to this channel and like what you saw, please consider subscribing. My goal is to hit 500 subscribers by the end of the summer. So I'd appreciate you subscribing and turn the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. I also have an Instagram account for the pictures I take when visiting a park. So be sure to check that out as well via the link in the description of this video. As for the next vlog you'll be seeing from the channel, he and I might try and go to Six Flags St. Louis next Sunday. And so if that's the case, the next vlog will be from there. But if not, the next vlog will be from, I think, Dollywood. So I will be getting on Big Bear Mountain for my first time and hopefully getting a second ride on Lightning Rod. If that's exciting for you, I recommend you subscribe like I said before and stay tuned for the next video. And until then, I'll see you guys later. Thank you.